Heaven I I2, Nikosi Baba is here. With the final continuation on free form locks. And as we know already, we are free from locks. We have keys. These are keys. Everywhere you see is keys. It's just keying up naturally. You don't have to twist it. You don't have to touch nothing. Your hair will form this way straight from an afro. And even if you don't have the afro with the world called kinky hair, don't worry, any kind of human can do this. Some of it, some, some humans, it, it flows differently than others, though every human can do this. It's simple. So just, just free up yourself, man. This video, to finalize this topic, I want to briefly touch on even the idea of trees. You see all these trees behind me? Trees are literally just like a prime example on how because we're still focusing on males. I'll do videos about hair with females. We're, we're going to get to that. But this, we're specifically talking about freeform locks as it relates to males. Keys as it relates to males. A tree. Let's use a tree right now. And I've done this previously. If anybody that's been iScribed for a while, you've seen when I've done topics like talking about coconut trees. I'm on a beach somewhere on an island and I'm, I'm decoding like how the coconut tree is actually literally you. And now to elaborate on that when you look at all these trees these trees are like fig trees they're bearing natural fruits for the abundance of like monkeys birds many different beings around here i'm not going to necessarily like try to go run up to them right now um my point though is that and if y'all been watching y'all already seen that we have nothing to like really prove we're not trying to bait nobody um i'm simply sharing this message a tree is not as productive energetically if it doesn't have its leaves or even branches and if a branch break it's going to want to grow it again if it, if a leaf fall off it's going to grow it again just like your body in a day thousands of hairs are falling but thousands more are growing daily so who taught us that we got to go to barbershops a male is not going to be as productive spiritually physically mentally he won't even have the same ability to manifest if he doesn't have his keys. How are you going to tap into the abundance of the universe if you ain't got a key to open the door? Grow your keys. Free up yourself. And then you have Rasta songs that kind of like mislead most of the children of the Most High. You know, even some of my cousins, you know, Morgan Heritage. You don't have to dread to be Rasta. <laughs> Well, there's truth to that. How? Because these are not dreads. The world calls it dreads. The, world's make, the world make you think it's dreadful. But ain't nothing dreadful about this. It's beautiful. Even if people think I'm ugly, guess what? I'm straight. I know what I am. Um, so they're right in the sense that you don't have to be dread because we don't want to be dreadful. Though they mislead most because people are going to think like, wait, that means I don't have to have keys on my head to be a spiritual being. No, they probably don't even realize it. And I'm going to tell it right now. Hopefully they can hear this. Share this with them, whoever got a link to them. They cousins and stuff, but they, everybody cousins in Jamaica. They probably don't even really remember me. Uh, the point, though, is that, yeah, you're right. Um, keys are the answer, especially if you're a male and you have a family, you have people you care about, you have to, like, Look out for people. You have to like have other people's best interests at heart, not just your own selfish desires. Keys are important, man. I'm telling you, it, it can even cover somebody from demons. Now, I do want to also briefly touch on this Bible quote. There's a part of the Bible where it talk about like, you know, does nature not show you that it's a shame for a male to have hair? Because <sighs> there's been Christian minded people and you know, uh, different people in the world that have argued with me years ago. Um, and they use this verse. They even say like, oh, a male, it's a shame for a male to be uh, uncovered. Oh, it is, a, it is a shame for a female to be uncovered. And it's a shame for a male to be covered. Something like that. I'm, I'm paraphrasing. It's not word for word. So don't, nobody beat me up in the comments if I'm... You get the point. Now, 
All of this is allegory. I already decoded this previously in a freeform lock video. Um, first and foremost, I will simplify for it for anyone that's sighting, and I hope this registers in a, in the faculties of your mind. I hope it clicks, and it and it makes sense for you, not for me. I don't matter. The Bible is literally simply saying that a male. It's a shame for him to to have somebody like ruling him per se, like because he has to cover the female. It's not shameful if a female is covered. It's it's shameful if a female is uncovered. Meaning, for example, like widows. It's better for a widow to be married than to be by herself. It's good for a female to have guidance, to have protection. Some people will perceive this and think like, oh, that's so misogynistic. A female could do whatever a male can do. <sighs> Don't get caught in the world spells. It's a big illusion. A male can't do what a female can do by nature, and a female cannot do what a male can do by nature. Don't let the world fool you. It's all an illusion. And by the way, this is a female's earth. We're just here. Like, we're just like seeds here that's dropped from the universe, the universe. We're not even dropped. We're sent from the universe to just share information. We're the giving aspect of life and the female is the receiver with a plug that goes right into the wall and it is very important for us to keep in mind and be mindful the importance of being yourself how can we be ourselves? first and foremost stop going to the barbershop Barbershops formed from a barbaric life. That's why it's called barbershops. It's barbaric in nature. Think about it. Barber. What's a barber? A barbaric shop. It's a slave tool to enforce slavery. What do I mean? Think of Hitler. Go look it up on Google for yourself if you trust Google. Hitler said, what's one of the first steps to making a slave? Cut his hair off. Now, ladies, do you want your king, your mate, your partner, do you want him to be your king or your slave? <laughs> I guess some females now want a slave. They don't want a real male to actually really protect them. I told, I told everyone already, the simple groundation of all of this is the male is the protector. The female is the nurturer. Nothing more, nothing less. All that extra stuff is just coloring that was put from the world to paint a different picture. The clear, simple picture and groundation of everything is protector, male, nurturer, female. Now, a male looking just like his female, how he gonna really protect her? Dudes is gonna run up every second and probably just throw him down. Even if the dude can't fight, just having keys alone, it, it serves as some kind of like intimidation factor. It's like in nature where you have a, a being that might even look bigger than another being or his hair looks bigger that makes him like perceived as a larger animal. That alone to ward off threats, literally. So it's spiritual before it's physical. Grow your hair. Some might feel like, I don't gotta grow my hair, I could box, I could fight. All right, you, you might win a few, you going, every dog have their day. You get what I'm saying? I don't, I don't won many fights, and you best believe I lost a couple as well. So what's more important than be able to, what's more important than being able to, to box it out and you know, square up and all that is actually being able to box your demons spiritually, being able to move things, moving your entire universe, being the actual like being in the seat of the most eye, sight in the full hundred. Sight what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, sexual life morphism 101, sexual dimorphism, they call it. Um, it's a reason why nature or why God has made it so. For the male to express hair through his face male or female will grow hair on their head okay why don't females grow hair on their face we don't ask these questions hmm we'll ask it now and the answer and the key to your answers is to have your keys grow your keys you'll be able to open doors more efficiently you won't be closed off from the source a male has to be able to receive from the source so he can be able to be resourceful to his family and to people he care about. Most times we think, oh, I want to be a good provider. How can we be a good provider as, as males? 
Now, some females that was with me previously in the world, they might be like, oh, don't listen to him. Nikosi's not a good provider. He only give $500 to his children this year. Listen, money don't make somebody a provider. It's the end of the world. Money don't exist. Money make a man, it, it determines how good of a slave a man is. A male being a good provider is a male that's saying, wait, hold up. This system is not suitable spiritually for my family and people that I say I love and care about. So let's make a move. Let's change the narrative. Keys is what's do that. I'm, I'm so bad with English now. <laughs> Keys are what does that. Keys, it starts to open and unlock things in the man. He's like, hold up. Nah, something ain't right. I'm not giving my children vaccines. Putting my children in school? What the heaven is school? I should just go walk into this tree and make y'all see all these beings. Ain't none of these beings worried about school. Are we not worth more than them? Oh, but we're more intelligent than them, so we got to go to sc schools and stuff to be more slaves. <sighs> to be a good provider, male, listen, this is for your own salvation. I don't need you to come message me again in the future like, yo, Nikosi, you changed my life. Some of y'all do that, and I, this is not what I'm doing that for. I'm not doing this for the praise aspect or the glory. It don't matter if only one person or 10 people or 100 people, life has changed. As long as somebody receives this message and it can benefit them for the sake of the truth, that is it, the truth. The truth must be shared. It won't be televised, but iTube is going to stream it. And even beyond iTube, the earth, is, the earth is streaming it nonstop. The, the thing, though, is that most humans, their focus is on these devices, and the devices became very divisive. So while using the device, I want to use it for a righteous, a right, just perspective. And then I'm going to disappear. Yeah. So make use of this, because it's the end of the world. <laughs> After a while, Nikosi Baba gone. And when I say gone, no, I'm not going to die. The government not going to get me. Nikosi is not going to be traceable by any internet. We are sovereign beings. We can't be on the internet and talk about we woke. Let me rephrase that. We can't be attached to the internet talking about we woke. Woke people can come on the internet in hopes to just share some light with other people that are destined to receive that light. In the same breath. If, how woke are we if we just attach ourselves to the internet for the rest of our life? That's not even reality. I'm not a YouTuber. This is iTube, and I'm streaming I through this tube to give something to I. That's it. Even while even listening to this, I'm hearing myself, and I know it's useful. It's full of use, so make use of it, because time is up. Don't you see? Time is up. Male, be a key for your family. You love your family, right? Stop cutting yourself. You're cutting yourself off, literally. Deforestation. It's all symbolic. We deforest the earth because we deforest ourselves. Meaning we're, we're closed. We're not far no more. You cite that? Because if we deforest something, that means we're not the forest no more. We're not far gone. We're closed off. We're not far on into reality. We're not in the forest no more. We're closed in society. I hope that I cite this. At least somebody, um, I hope this helps. That's all. Um, I subscribe to this channel. If you are a high scarab, share this with all of your loved ones. Uh, happy new earth <laughs> that's the type wave we on new earth order seagull order get into tune in tap in grasp hold on let go let god let god take pro troll of your life we don't want no more control we want pro troll males let's be better leaders for our family let's truly have everyone's best interests at heart even if it's perceived by them that you have a bad interest for them. Let's keep our heart light as a feather. Let's, free, let's be free and have a free dome. We talk about free, free form locks. I don't think locks can be free formed. Locks are blockages. 
These keys are free from locks, as we've established. And we bear many beautiful fruits in our life. You'll know them by the fruits that they bear. Grow your trees, your branches, your, your roots, your nati roots, your keys to life. So you can bear the abundance of what you truly are. Guide our hill, I grow. I have I. Seagull Empire, big up yourself.